Now see uh, oscillations of loaded spring. First one is vibration in horizontal direction. So first one is here vibrations in horizontal direction. Suppose you have taken a spring like this and a mass is attached here. This surface is frictionless. When the mass is attached and this mass is suppose displaced to this side by a small displacement suppose y. Then the restoring force act to this side that is also called a spring force. This is here F is equal to F s is equal to minus k y. So, F s is directly proportional to negative of the displacement. So, obviously the motion is simple harmonic. So, we can write the formula for the time period or we can equate it minus m omega square y and k is equal to m omega square. When you solve it, you will be getting time period is equal to 2 pi under root m upon k. So, see here in this case it is here the time period of this oscillation of the spring it will go to this side as you release it it will come back to the mean position or equilibrium position it will overshoot this mean position and comes to this side. So, it will keep on oscillating suppose between this and this point and this will be here the fixed position that is called mean position or equilibrium position. So, time period will be given here t equal to 2 pi under root of m upon k where m is the inertia factor and k is a spring factor. And frequency formula you can write here nu is equal to 1 upon 2 pi under root of k upon m.